Hello everyone, in this video we'll look at how to load a model into Light Tracer Render. First method, click on the burger menu and select Load Scene. In the pop-up window, choose your file and click Open. A dialog box with various parameters will appear in the program. Usually you don't have to worry about these. The most important are the last three buttons replace substitutes the original scene with a new one. Add inserts a new object into the existing scene and cancel stops the loading process. In this case, select replace to load your model into Light Tracer Render. The open file comes with its own textures and materials. Let's see what this model is made of. Open the left panel. In the sketchfab underscore scene folder, there are two files. Click on them one by one and you will see the selected objects highlighted in the viewport. In the right panel, under the texture section, the loaded textures are displayed. Light Tracer Render supports importing the most common 3D formats, such as OBJ, STL, Ply, Zipped Guilty F2.0, FBX, Day, 3DM, as well as StepIG's CAD formats. Let's explore the second method of uploading a file into the program. Drag the desired file from the folder into the program's viewport. As soon as a white dashed line appears, release the mouse button. The familiar loading window will then appear. As we can see, the step file has loaded as a single object. To facilitate working with this object, it needs to be divided into pieces. To do this, select the unknown model in the viewport, right-click to open the menu, choose Process Mesh, and then Split into Parts. A small window will appear asking Split into Separate Parts, where you should click Perform and wait a bit. Now our object is divided into meaningful parts and can be painted. Thank you for watching and subscribe to the channel to stay updated with new tutorial videos.